Okay, I'm visiting this leak again, and right here is the metal that would likely be part of the built-in east trough because the height of the wall outdoors, so there's the overhangs that go down, and the east trough is out there on that. So this wall right here, this height, you can see that from outdoors because that makes up what would be the built-in east trough and the overhang. And you can see right in there, and then you, you can see where there would be step flashing. Step flashing would go all the way down through there, but there isn't. There's a tar that's painted onto the wall. It's in good shape, too. It's thick. You can see how wet this is right here. That's water dripping from the ice and snow we had yesterday. It's dripping water. And as you come uphill, you can see the metal, either that's part of the built-in east trough, and this ice and water shield is under it. It's not out on top of it, which I don't know if that matters because I'm not really sure what's going on. But I can see water. Okay, that's wet right there. Boy, that's just... Okay, this that piece of wood right there is wet. And that is an old piece of what I'm touching right there is an old shake, wooden shake. It's really wet right there. Now there's ice and water up underneath here. This is ice and water all the way over. But I'm guessing we're up underneath that ease trough. That feels like felt. But there's water up as high as where the valley would dump. Where the valley dumps onto this roof. This secondary roof. There's already water showing itself. So, but you can see the ice and water there, ice and water there, ice and water, all that. And that's the valley, that's the upper valley that comes down. So I'm guessing that this area where the built-in east trough starts, it was problematic right from the get-go. And... It, which would have required some really intense practices for making sure that that couldn't leak. And it may not be possible. It may be the nature of the beast. I don't know. I'd like to ask Ed and Pat McHugh if they remember this area and how tricky it was to actually keep it from getting wet. Yeah, see, there's there's water on the underside of this ice and water, and it's just it's just dripping right there on me as I was <clears throat> filming it. It was dripping on me. Okay, let me go look at the other areas.